Today, we've got a jam-packed video covering the latest tech news from around the world. From groundbreaking developments in AI to major data leaks, we've got it all covered. So, let's dive right in. First up, let's talk about Apple's latest move into the world of artificial intelligence. According to reports from Chinese media, Apple is set to purchase AI services from Baidu, a Chinese tech giant. This collaboration hints at Apple's significant push into generative AI services, especially evident in the upcoming iOS and macOS updates. Baidu's renowned AI model, Ernie Bot, boasts capabilities similar to ChatGPT and is praised for its human-like responses. While neither company has officially confirmed the collaboration, given Apple's need for region-specific AI models approved by Chinese regulators, Baidu seems like a likely partner for Apple's ambitions in this space. In other news, China has announced new guidelines banning the use of Intel and AMD microprocessors in government-operated computers and servers. This move comes as a response to increasing sanctions on tech products from the U.S. and its allies. The directive also aims to phase out Microsoft's Windows operating system in favor of domestic alternatives. This highlights China's efforts to bolster domestic semiconductor production and reduce reliance on foreign suppliers, particularly from the U.S. and Taiwan. Now, let's shift our focus to Apple's rumored plans for the Vision Pro. According to reports, Apple is developing a pencil that will be compatible with the Vision Pro, allowing users to utilize it with drawing applications like Freeform and Pixelmator. While details remain scarce, rumors suggest that Apple may unveil this new pencil next month. Moving on to a concerning revelation about Facebook's Onavo VPN. Court documents in an ongoing antitrust lawsuit reveal how Onavo VPN was used to track Snapchat data for a project called Ghostbusters. This raises serious questions about user privacy and data security. In other news, Apple has announced that its 35th WWDC will be held online from June 10 to June 14. The keynote event will unveil exciting updates, including iOS 18, iPadOS 18, tvOS 18, macOS 15, watchOS 11, and visionOS 2. Meanwhile, Micron has unveiled its massive 256GB DDR5-8800 MKRDIM memory modules tailored for next-gen AI servers. These modules promise to enhance server performance with increased DRAM content, although they come with a hefty price tag. Next up, OpenAI has introduced Voice Generation, a new AI tool capable of creating synthetic voices from just 15 seconds of audio. While this technology shows promise, concerns about potential misuse and misinformation have prompted OpenAI to proceed cautiously. Speaking of OpenAI, former president of Google China, Kai-Fu Li, predicts that OpenAI could become the world's first privately held company with a $1 trillion valuation within the next two to three years. This highlights the immense potential of AI technologies in shaping the future of tech. Switching gears to a major development in the ongoing antitrust lawsuit against Meta, formerly Facebook. Newly unsealed court documents suggest that Meta allowed Netflix access to users, private messages, and DMs, raising serious concerns about user privacy and data protection. Lastly, we have news about a recent data leak at AT&T. The company has reset millions of customer account passcodes following the leak, which exposed encrypted passcodes that could potentially be deciphered. This incident underscores the importance of robust cybersecurity measures in safeguarding user data. And there you have it, folks. A roundup of the latest tech news making waves around the world. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates. Until next time, stay tuned and stay tech savvy.